Okay, so I wanted to show you this update to the Ethereum wallet in Mist. Um, if you're unfamiliar with what Mist is, it's a decentralized browser that you can use within the Ethereum Core wallet. Okay, and I use it religiously every day because uh, you can keep everything Ethereum uh, within the one uh, UI. Okay, so I just noticed that they've just done this update. Uh, and what's really cool is if you are familiar with the ENS, which is the domain names, the new domain names for the Ethereum network, which are going to have a lot of different features. Um, you can use them for transactions and for dApps and all sorts of things. Um, it's really cool because now within the Ethereum wallet, you can actually send two names just by typing it in and it will bring it up. Okay. Um, and also the other thing which is really cool is you have uh, support for... Uh, tokens as well so like normally I have a my ether wallet and also metamask right and I've uh, bought tokens with both and you have to for example with my ether wallet I have to go to the you know the, to the browser log in um, and then I can see my tokens within there so what what I've done with the mist with the ethereum wallet is I've imported the my my ethereum wallet account in to the mist wallet into the ethereum wallet and also the metamask so they're actually inside the wallet so now i can do everything within the one ui okay and it just makes it more convenient and i really like it but what they've done with this uh, update is they've enabled it so that you can add the tokens uh, and you know visualize display them within the ethereum wallet okay so i'm going to show you this it's really cool um, if, so this here is Mist, okay? Now, the good thing about Mist, or the great thing about Mist, is that it's a decentralized browser as well, okay? So this is really, this is a, a big plus. You can also uh, have multiple wallets, multiple Ethereum addresses in here. You can also uh, plug in your ENS registrar, so you can do all your Ethereum domains through here, and you can also, which is really cool, is you can add Ether Delta, which is the decentralized exchange, which is where I buy all my tokens. Okay, so, so I'm gonna show you what they've done. So basically here you can see that uh, I have, I've just called it Mu um, for my Ether wallet, but if I click on this, you can see now that I've got um, Pillar and Populous and Veritasium, okay? So I've got these showing in here. I have got MGO as well. I've got a few of those in my Ether wallets, but I wanted to show you that, um, how to actually add it here. So, you know, this is very cool. So, and you can also get up to contracts and you can see down here, see, it gives you all the uh, information on your tokens. So, and this is all within the one UI, all right? So I'm gonna show you how to add another one. Um, so if you come down to watch token and just add that, I'm going to come down and get, you need the token contract address, okay, um, and I use the site, uh, this one here, just come back, and if I click on mobile go, um, I use the site Ethplora, and it gives you a, um, uh, all the information about, you know, your holdings on your wallet, but anyway, this is where you can get your contract addresses from, so I'm going to grab the contract address here for the MGO token. Now, that's all I need. Okay, so because it's attached to my EtherWallet address, which I have within the Mist wallet here, okay? So all I have to do is, to the token contract address, is paste that in here and you can see everything comes up. Okay, it's perfect. And then I just go, okay. And it automatically uh, brings in your mobile go token. So now it's displayed and it shows you the amount and everything, so it's all nice, everything's nice in the UI. So now there's a lot of things that you can do um, with this Mist wallet, but I'll show you in more detail and maybe do an overview on the ENS and the uh, Delta Exchange, Ether Delta. But you know, if you just look up here, if I just click on here, browse, it's just like a regular browser. See, I've logged in uh, to Steam it. Okay, so, and the ENS, this is where you can, uh, you know, handle all your all your ether names um, or buy more there's a lot still available and i'm going to show you this one quickly so what i did was i just set this up um, which i can show in another video and it's just called eight limbs you know for eight limbs for fighting um, and i'm going to show you what happens uh, if i want to send some uh, 
let's say for example I want to send some Ethereum to that 8limbs.f, that domain name. If I come back to wallets, uh, come back to wallets and if I go to my MetaMask one and if I just come up to send and if I start typing in here, for example, say your friend has the, the F domain eight limbs, you can type it in here. Um, T L I M B S, and you can see already it's it's already associated with it an address. So if I just click outside there, you can see it's actually added the address here, so you can actually see what it is. But now you can use this directly in in Mist. Okay, so it's just everything's becoming a lot easier, which is you know hopefully they'll do something about the gas in the future, <laughs> or maybe EOS can uh, uh, can can create something like this, but without well they are already without the fees. Hopefully they do something with the uh, you know EOS domains as well it would be really cool so I just wanted to show you that um, and don't forget there's Ether Delta um, which is an incredible way to buy tokens um, and believe me you can get some amazing if you're a trader uh, you can get some amazing deals through Ether Delta okay it's a bit you got you got to work it out a little bit how to use it but I use it within here um, I don't sell anything uh, within Mist because you can't at this point in time you can only buy tokens um, if you want to sell anything you have to use the browser version of Ether Delta but this is a great place if you want to get some really good deals if you're a trader of tokens okay so that's a tip alright so I just wanted to show you that and uh, just remember that you can with your wallets here you can uh, you know you can import as many Ethereum wallets as you want um, and you can create new ones right here okay so remember it's it's the Ethereum Core Wallet, which you obviously need the chain, um, and then you download the Mist. Okay, so you can see it. I'll just quickly show you here. We come back here, um, and you scroll down. You can see here that you you'll need to get the uh, Ethereum Wallet first, and then you get the Mist down here. So if you're on Windows, for example, um, you can get the Windows 64 here, the Ethereum Wallet, and then you can get the Mist. Uh, where are you? Miss 64 down here. Okay, and there is a way of speeding up the actual sync as well, which I can show in another video as well. But if you've got any questions, uh, make sure to subscribe. And if you've got any questions, hit me up in the comment section. Peace out.